A7. Right. Right. Uh, you want an output voltage of 24. And the input voltage is 125. And the N1 is what you want. The N2 is 216. Oh, well, this is for babies. Even I can do this one. Right, uh, V1 over V2 equals N1 over N2. So N1 is V1 over V2 N2. 1, 2, 5 over 24 times 2, 1, 6. And we get the right answer. 1, 1, 2, 5. And then part 2. Uh, what is the current when the resistance is 8? Is that all? What's the current in the primary circuit? Oh, when the secondary circuit is connected across an 8 ohm resistor. So the resistance in the second one is 8. Well, does that mean I have to find the current, doesn't it? Ah, mm -hmm. uh, rats. Is there any quick way to do this? Mm -hmm. What? Mm -hmm. No. No, there should be. It's only two marks. <laughs> <coughs> do we know the current to begin with? Mm. No, so I'm going to have to find that. Fine. Uh, so you have VIR. So I1 equals... No, we don't know the OR1, do we? No, so I have to start with finding current t 2. I2 is V2 over OR2, which is 24 over 8, which is 3, isn't it? Exactly 3 amps. That's what I'm going to do next. So you know that V1 over V2 equals I2. One, I2 two over I1. Yeah. yeah, or actually that feels weird. I'm going to say it like this. I1 over I2 equals N2 over N1. That feels better. And which are we looking for? The I1, is it? Yeah, okay. So then I1 equals N2 over N1 times I2. Uh, what's N2? 1125. No. What's N2? 216 over 1125. Zero point five seven six amps, which is correct. Yeah? That's it.